Hello everybody, Brad Pointer here with another episode of Zafe House Diaries. No survivors. Uh, today, uh, I've got some bad news. Uh, luckily, nobody commented and said, hey, you should do this because I couldn't. Um, apparently, I had to make a choice before I could save the game. And so I had to make the choice so that I could save it and come back to it at a later time, as I do. And it was just no bueno. Uh, <clears throat> what they did, I chose to give them some food instead of turning them away. Because I figure they're a bunch of people. And if they're hungry, they may come back and eat me. And I don't like that. We don't need to be losing people to cannibals in caravans. So what we're going to do is we, we, we just started. We, we chose it. And I'll, I'll just start off here by reading this first day uh, or this first hour at 2 a.m. And I'll let you guys see what happened. Saturday, December 19th, 2 a.m., the store. Megan, with an H, ate a snack. A caravan arrived at the store. Inside were some men, women, and children. They looked hungry and weak. Some of them were carrying weapons. We gave them two cooking ingredients, 11 small meals, and 21 snacks, and they moved on. Kristen didn't make any progress on her trap. Megan has almost finished modifying the shotgun with an H. Megan, without an H, prepared a small meal. She stopped preparing meals because she ran out of ingredients, because they gave them away. Ah, uh, okay. So, first thing we need to do is say, oh my word! And what we want to do is we need to get, we, we're right next to the university already. Now, this house doesn't have enough furniture. We've already established that it does not have enough furniture. But the only thing else is the bank. And the bank is another one. So we're not going to be able to make our sniper post that I wanted to make. Um, and it looks like that those people, that they, if the, they'll honk if you don't give them stuff, I think. I think that's what happens. And then all the zombies come. And I didn't want that to happen. So... Uh, but anyway, we got some, still got some zombies around here. Uh, so we're going to tell, have everybody patrol outside and whoop zombies for this first round. And then we might get to sniping. Or at least preparing for the sniping. Arguing has escalated into a fight. No one was injured. Oh, thank goodness. Uh, Christy, Megan, Megan, and Kristen attacked a zombie while on patrol. They took care of them. Christy struck a zombie in his head with a baseball bat, killing it instantly. Well, she's a good girl. Okay. So we're going to go over here, and we're going to tell him not to do that anymore. We're gonna, who can, nobody can modify anything. Okay, Megan, just because, you, well, hang on. Since nobody can do that, who's the best at uh, signaling for survivors? That'd be Christy. So we're going to then... Uh, tell yeah it, Megan you go ahead and get get some sniping going on um, everybody else just um, well actually who would that be um, we've got Megan and Christy so guitar pick and uh, the other the other Megan would it be guitar pick and lifesaver no, no, hang on. Megan. With, yeah, okay. And Lifesaver. They are going to go down here. And uh, we're telling them to breach with nothing because we've already secured that place. So we know there's no zombies in there. We know there's no zombies back here. We don't need any weapons. What we need is to grab ammo because we don't have any bolt-action rifle rounds. And if we're going to snipe things, we really need some bolt action rifle rounds and this place just happens to have an ammunition manufacturing facility and so we will be able to do wonderful things there so this is the first time i've split these guys up um and it's actually 
I don't usually split my team up. Uh, so this is kind of a spur of the moment thing that I'm trying. Uh, Kristen jumped in the show in the shower with some soap. Uh, she feels clean and fresh. There was no shower. There was no soap. She's mad. Okay. And Christy and Megan, I left them in the house, and their constant bickering is getting everyone down from the house over. So, wow. You guys need to chill. Okay, so now you guys, since you're here, how, what do we have? We don't have any of that, so we're going to have to produce some ammo. Um, and we're going to tell both of these guys to get on the rifle rounds. Make us some rifle rounds. You ever made rifle rounds? Well, you going to now. Oh. A zombie wandered too close to a secured window, and Christy grabbed a fire axe and sliced its right foot. Megan is still getting started on the shotgun. Shotgun? You got a bolt-action rifle there. That's the sniper. You don't put a scope on the shotgun. You stoop. Uh, Megan says she's feeling secure in the factory. Looks like they didn't make no rifle rounds. You guys make me rifle rounds. Make me rifle rounds like a record. But no, you're not. You're not making any rifle rounds. Why aren't you making rifle rounds? Um... So, yeah, these guys. Christy says she is feeling secure in the store. Well, good for you, Christy. Um, the secure doors and windows should slightly dampen the noise. Um, are you still signaling sur for survivals? For survivals? Yes. Here's the eye of survival. What's this? A signal. Yep, you're still doing it. So you got to keep on doing it. What are, what are you waiting on me for? Get to making some, I want some rifle rounds. It's been a couple hours since Megan made any progress on the modifications to the shotgun. Yeah, because there's not a scope mount on a shotgun, you idiot. You gonna duct tape it to there? Oh, oh. And Megan and Kristen, oh, somebody, they got into a fight, didn't they? No, zombie wandered too close to a secured window, and Megan grabbed the fire axe again and chopped its right foot. Did they do the right foot last time? Because if not, then that poor little zombie is walking around on some heels and I don't think they have that good a balance so they probably walking around on their knees at this point so we got a, a knee walking oh yeah Kelsey oh. <laughs> really okay so we got we got Megan and Megan we got Kristen and Christy and Kelsey so yeah here we go Kristen doesn't want her to join the group well Kristen that's just because you are not a nice person. So everybody else likes this chick. You are the only one who don't like her. And she's got a baseball bat and a golf club and a semi-automatic rifle. And hopefully she knows how to modify something so we can actually put somebody that knows what they're doing on the putting the scope on the rifle. Or making the, making the ammo. Either one of those. And that would be groovy. So where are you at? Kelsey. Oh. Kelsey is good. Okay. All right. Now we may actually see something happen. Um, and what are you going to do? Megan is idle. Okay. And Christy is rested. Oh, Christy went and laid down. And we didn't really notice. So that's bad. Um, anybody need to go outside and whack some zombies? Anybody need to go see if they're any good at making... Yeah, that's what she needs to do. She, who is a what... What are you? Are you the... Yeah, Megan, you're the little coin. So you go down here to coin land. And you're going to breach this place. You don't need to take anything. Don't think you have anything to take. Oh, we still got some small meals. So, so, so see, they didn't clean us out completely. They just almost cleaned us out completely. So we shouldn't starve to death. That, that's always a bonus. So now, get everybody doing stuff. Uh... Kelsey is modifying a shotgun. Kelsey, I don't know what it is, but you guys need to to figure out the fact that shotguns are not sniper weapons. They are not. I can tell you this. I know. Oh, and Megan is awesome at making rifle rounds, so maybe between the three of these chicks, they can figure it out. And I don't mean any offense by that. Please don't 
take what I say about the ladies. I love ladies, and I, I, I've got three daughters, and I love them very much. Um, it's just my teenage vernacular tends to pop out when I'm doing these Let's Plays, and I don't know why, but um, some old school ways of saying things may come out. So don't worry about it, okay? Word. Um, anyway, uh, doo -doo -ba -doo. what are you guys doing? Or did you make some rifle rounds? Did they? Did they? Oh, Kelsey, okay, a semi-automatic rifle? I'll take that. Nobody, can nobody make rifle rounds? Because you should be making me. Oh, they're now they're pretty, now they got some rifle rounds are rolling. All right, but we got zombies outside. So what do we do about that? Hmm. What a predicament. So now we've got our party split. What do we do? What do we, what do we do about it? Waddle waddle. Waddle waddle. So we've only got eight long rifle rounds. Oh, who's the who's the butt kicker? Um. Who's good at butt kicking? Uh, let's see, patrol outside. Megan's okay at it with an H. I know, guys, it's hard. <clears throat> That's not my fault. <laughs> Don't blame me. Uh, let's see, Christy's sleeping, so she can't do nothing. But can't. Oh, and Christy, who is my sleepy chick, and Kelsey. So these two should go outside and whoop everybody in the face. Uh, I'd forgotten who my face whoopers were. Um, so we'll see. Okay, let's just go again. Chris, oh, Christy is idle now. Oh, oh, I thought she was still napping. So you got to get out here and beat zombies in the head. Go around both buildings if you would, please. But I know you won't. Megan says she is feeling secure in the factory. I don't care. Uh, They took care of them. Oh, so it's just one? They took care of it. It's just one dude out there. All right, that's crazy, but that's cool too. All right, so now, what are we gonna do? We're going to get back to modifying. Kelsey, modify, modify me a sniper rifle, and I want I want a rifle. I don't want none of this pansy shotgun stuff that you've been you've been pushing. Let's see. A steady shotgun, yeah, a steady shotgun. Close combat sniping, it's modified for sniping now, and it's now has one star in sniping because it's a shotgun. You, oh, mm, uh, okay. So anyway, um, you keep doing that, and Christy, um, I tell you what, Christy, what? Who are you? You're the rock. All right, come down here. <laughs> oh, oh, old commercials. Why do you enter my brain at such times when it would be naughty? Because she's the rock and Prudential Life Insurance, their logo or their their theme song used to be get a piece of the rock. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, my joke for the day. Uh, Megan, Christy and Megan waited for the right moment to let Christy inside. Kristen cut herself on some broken factory equipment. We produced three rifle rounds. Kelsey is modifying a bolt action rifle. Okay, good job. That's the one that's the one we want you to modify. Okay? And with this we want some rifle rounds produced. Now, Christy, what you're going to do though, okay, you're gonna make some food because you're good at it. So you go. Day knocking. Day knocking, but they can't come in. And she's halfway through modifying the bolt action rifle. So that's good. Um, how many rifle rounds do we have now? 14. Oh, this is going to take forever because they're going to go through that in like 10 minutes. Maybe that's why. She was like, We ain't got no bullets, boss. I'm going to modify this shotgun so we can at least be shooting at them. I mean, yeah, it's basically a turkey choke that I've put in there to make it steady, but. No. Okay. So, okay. What are we going to do? Well, let's leave the one person who can actually make rifle rounds. Leave her over here making rifle rounds because we, that needs to happen. And then we're going to have Rocket, um, Guitar Pick, uh, 
Oh no, Megan's the one producing and Lifesaver. We're gonna have them go back over here, but they're gonna carry bunches of stuff. That's the plan. Uh, let's see. All the ammos. We need all that ammo. We need all the cooking ingredients and we'll leave that small meal for um, for uh, whoever we leave Megan so that she can you know be happy and have something to eat. Maybe she'll be happier by herself. Maybe that's what I should do. Maybe I should just put them all in different houses so they don't fight. That'd be oh yeah without anybody's help trying to help she produced six while when the other guys were helping she produced three so that tells me that she is the person who's going to be doing that alone from now on um let's see how are you doing on the sniper rifle these people are idle so they need to to stop being idle uh kristen who's hurt kristen is so kristen fix thyself um christy you go back to prepared meals and that leaves megan being idle and so what we're going to have her do is try to make traps, even though she is just not any good at it. We're still going to try it. Uh, Kelsey's making good progress to the modifications to the shotgun. What? Did you finish? Did you? Did you? Did you finish that last time? Scoped bolt action rifle. Oh, yeah. So now do we have anybody that's good at sniping? Christy. Okay. Are you done cooking, Christy? You done? Did you finish cooking? Megan is feeling secure in the factory. That's good because you're the only one there, Megan. You just keep making them them bullets. Uh, Kristen is idle. Why are you idle? Oh, because she healed herself. Good job. Uh, do, 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 do. Who was good at it? And who else can prepare a meal? Kelsey can prepare a meal. Kelsey's busy, yeah. Well, Kelsey done made the the sniper rifle, so we're we're good there. So, Kelsey, you prepare this meal. Christy, get around here and shoot zombies inside the university at Two Golden Hill Road, because that's right here. And they're like probably from ten to fifteen zombies inside there, uh, depending on how late in the game it is and it's not very late in the game so probably more like 10 um 11 ish but how many how many bullets do we have 14 that means we'll probably might get i think it's about 25 percent. so we're not going to get very much but then we're going to have when she runs out of uh, 223 she's going to switch over to something else and she may use that sniper shotgun that they made which is completely useless but it may actually kill a zombie, so why not? Okay, here we go. Uh, Kristen, oh, Kristen, what, are, what was you supposed to be doing? Did I, you just make some traps with her. Let's see if you guys can get into a good fist fight. Oh yeah, bow bow. Shoot him in the head. Uh, Cutler and glue clap, trap, yeah, good job. Uh, yeah, she's just over there producing rifle rounds like a little mad woman. Oh yeah, shoot him again. Shoot him again. Two zombies have been sniped and killed at the university. All right. Uh, how many bullets do we have left? Uh, we have four bullets left. So two. Yeah, that was less. Uh, maybe maybe ten percent. Oh, what was that third one? A block and glue trap, blah, blah, blah. Kelsey tried unsuccessfully to convince others to relax and have a drink. She is disappointed with everyone, but she's drunk. Uh, Kelsey is feeling slightly fit after doing some exercise. Um, okay, why didn't you... What, what happened? Did we run out of snipers? No. We ran out of bullets. Oh, the last... It was... Pew, 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 because she used the shotgun on them. Okay. Um, so this person, we're going to tell her, tell everybody, you guys just stop for a minute, okay? Everybody just chill. Now, go out here. This is going to make everybody feel better. Just go out here and hit some zombies with some baseball bats. That's going to help. Then you, you come back over here 
and you bring us oh yeah look she's made so many 22 to 23 rounds I keep wanting to say uh, 22 rounds but it's 223s there's a big difference between a 22 and a 223 one of them is shot out of m16s and ar-15s and other weapons like that while the other one is shot out of plinking rifles so we know there's a big difference so let's go ahead and grab some more cooking ingredients you guys want to eat nothing else you got to go back and take the gut over there. yeah they struck down three of them i bet there's another one so i bet there's a whole other bunch so you guys all go out there oh there wasn't i was wrong i like being wrong when it's about being surrounded by zombies we're surrounded by zombies oh no we're not oh cool I'm happily misinformed. Okay, now we're gonna go over here to the university. We're going to have Kelsey preparing some meals. We're gonna have. Yeah, why don't you guys, everybody, just go nuts, modify something, make it cool. Okay, you, you guys just use your imagination. I want to see a. Uh, blender with improved assault capabilities assault blender if you will uh, okay Megan is modifying a hammer other Megan is modifying a flashlight and Kristen is modifying a hard hat that's cool you guys chose some interesting things uh, Christy wounded a zombie with a shot okay she didn't kill it though but wounding is okay if they get wounded enough they'll die so we're decreasing the combat effectiveness at the university uh, they fought nobody got hurt good there was a slap fight and hair pulling but nobody actually got legs broke or anything so everything's cool um, Christy fatally shot a zombie in the torso a further three zombies have been killed so you shot that one zombie and it killed three more behind it that was a good uh, skillful lucky shot five zombies have been sniped and killed at the university okay so we should have probably at least five or six more um, when we when we get to that number then we'll chill uh, we might even you know like if we get to nine because I think we can take you know whatever we whatever we need to take we might assault the place first so that we can clear out the zombies from around it six zombies have been shot uh, in the shower she is grateful for the soap uh, Kelsey, why are you idle? Oh, did you run out of ingredients? Okay. Well, go over here and modify something. You got, it's Arts and Crafts Day in the zombie apocalypse. You guys just go crazy, make some stuff, do whatever you feel like you got to do. Uh, made some progress. Became frustrated with each other while modifying items. Well, I can understand. Modifying items can be frustrating. Especially when you're surrounded by people who don't know what they're doing. Uh, okay. There you go. I think we should go, probably go patrol outside. What do you think? I think that's a splendid idea. Because I think they're about to start eating people's brains. We don't want no brains eating. They're going to start knocking on the door. I think they'll probably knock on the door this time. Nope. But that's because we beat them in the face before they got there. That's right. And that was everybody. Pulled everybody and said, Go eat. Hit the zombies in the face. Um, let's see. Sorry, guys. We're going to have them patrol. No, 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 no. You guys get back to your item modification and Yep, yep, any capability, whatever you feel like, you know, make us some awesome stuff, golf club, fire axe, hard hat, yeah, total nine zombies, wow, okay, she got uh, four zombies that round, good job, so let's go ahead, we're going to do this, okay, everybody, get over here, and we're going to assault the university, and assaulting is different from breaching, because instead of going there to stay, you just go there, shoot everybody outside, and anybody you can see, and then you come back with 
out going in because you just want to clear out the outside of it and then you breach it then you go inside and take out whatever's left inside so that's how we do that but for this one we're getting we're gonna get like all the guns and the bats you're just gonna get everything and a hard hat bullets bullet, 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 bullet. okay we don't need any of that okay 25.85 I think we're good okay take the bar soap because bar soap never hurts we're gonna save this and go over here we're gonna assault that place beat them up boom 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 let them have it it's the way to do it um, large building with around 11 rooms five doors 28 windows leading in from the outside should contain some medical supplies <laughs> just being here will probably make us smarter while the gymnasium gym, 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 gymnasium and swimming pool will be good places to exercise that'll be good they assaulted the place they opened fire on four zombies lurking around outside they took them all down they couldn't see any zombies through the window but they could hear groaning and shuffling so there's still some in there uh, there are still zombies inside the university so the train so the team retreated back to the store. Kelsey, Megan, and they returned back, and they didn't have no trouble because they had already secured the place. So now, now, it's time for the breaching. Okay. And this time, what we need to do, what are we going to take? Uh, we need the hammer. Yeah, I got the bar soap. Got that. Okay. We're going to take a bunch of melee weapons. We're just going to weapon out again. Let's do that. Let's just take all the all the weapons. Oh, yeah. We don't need that many 9mm rounds. We need a hard hat more than that. And some bacon just in case somebody dies. Oh, no, not bacon. Beacon. Big difference between a beacon and some bacon. Although they're both shining examples of their thing. Oh my goodness. That was a bad dad joke. You guys like bad dad jokes? Okay. Do you like... Have you ever seen a gladiator movie? Um, okay. I'm going to save that just because we're silly. Um... We might take some medicine with us, but that, they said that they'd be medicine there. But here we go. We're hoping that nine zombies means that there's only a couple in there and not like 11 dozen. Does that sound like 11 dozen zombies? Doesn't look. Okay. Uh, a corpse zombie. Okay. Nine's up. Nine, two. Two. Two zombies inside. They go. Because I know that my Bradley's angels here with the five ladies with all the Megans and the, the Krill ladies um, they gonna do it okay we're still trying to clear out the remaining zombies small mob they got them all uh, blah 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 uh, there may be some zombies outside now there are some zombies they followed us over from our place so, so that's okay but we are still going to beat them about the head and face with baseball bats until they submit to our will. Struck down two of them. Roger that. Okay. Now, clean up corpses. Everybody seems to be so good at cleaning up corpses, except for Megan. Cleaning up corpses too good for you, Megan? Huh? You can't get your little delicate hands dirty? No, we got some tough girls up in here. Playing no sissy dress up. It's like my daughters certainly during the survival apocalypse during the zombie apocalypse. They'd be crazy. Ooh boy. They kill everybody. So okay, oh, we are up to our necks in time. So what we're gonna do is gonna go ahead and we've breached the uh we yeah, what did we do? We breached the university and now we've got to uh, secure it and uh, search it first of all Ooh, let's do that real quick 
Did you guys clean up? They didn't get all the corpses, so let's leave Kelsey. You, you go clean up that corpse by yourself. And you guys search, because I know this happens really quick. Yes. See that? That's a greenhouse. Um, let's see. They discovered a greenhouse filled with food-producing plants. It's not enough to feed the whole group, but it's better than nothing. And it's not enough to feed the whole group, but it's almost. And so, you know, maybe somebody has to go away. Somebody that people don't like. Um, which seems to be... Nobody really liked Kristen. But Kristen's pretty good. So, no, we'll just see what happens. Okay. Uh, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, then like it. And I'll catch y'all on the spatula side. Peace. Thank you.